This video is sponsored by HitPaw Photo Enhancer. HitPaw Photo Enhancer is the best AI image enhancer that requires just one click to enhance image quality and resolution and make pictures less blurry 100% automatically. To use the software, simply select the blurry photo from your computer and then select the AI model. Different AI models can help you depending on what the photo contains and the level of noise or blur. You can preview the final result before exporting the final photo and if you're happy with the result, you can click on the export button in the right side. Download HitPa Photo Enhancer from the links in the description below. And make sure to use the coupon code for a 30% discount. Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, I'm going to show you how to enable the new taskbar that is sitting in Windows 11, the build 22563. As I've said in previous videos, Microsoft is adding a lot of new features and changes and also fixes, of course, in Windows 11 in the dev channel. So if you want to be able to experience these new features or changes, you need to be in the latest build of the dev channel. Now, if you're in the latest build of the dev channel, I think you also notice that when you right click on the start menu, you get a explorer.exe crash and the explore.exe of course restarts by default and of course since windows 11 launched you know that we have this weird bug as you can see here we have a line that stops here when the system tray starts and we have some ugly designs for these buttons and for this tray i think this is the old design from windows 10 but microsoft is currently working on fixing this and also the crashes by working on a new improved taskbar and in this video i'm going to show you how to enable this hidden taskbar or hidden feature that we currently have in the build 22563. As I've said in previous videos, to enable all these hidden features, we are using Vive Tool, which is a tool that can help us find hidden features and also enable them in Windows 11. We're going to have the download link in the article down below in the description. Just go into this link, click on the zip file to download the latest version, open the file, click on extract all or right click on it and extract all, browse and look for system 32. Go into this PC, local disk C, go into the Windows location location and then scroll down to system 32 select it click on select folder click on extract in my case i'm going to have to replace those files and then click on continue and everything should be good to go i had to replace the files because i already extracted everything there after you've done this all you need to do is to open up cmd as administrator right click on cmd and then click on run as administrator on user account control click on yes in cmd you're going to have to paste in this command which is vive tool add config to 6008830 you're going to have this command in the article down below in the description so you can get it from there let's just run this as you can see we successfully run the command and the feature configuration is successfully set now all we need to do is to do a explorer.exe restart in order to see the changes and also to fix this crash so to do it we're just gonna right click on the start menu because windows helps us a bit here and that crash will help us to restart this explorer.exe so i'm just gonna right click as you can see the explorer.exe crashed and now we are on the new task bar in Windows 11. First of all, you're going to see that we are no longer having to deal with the crash when we right click on the start menu to access the Windows plus X menu. This is really good. This also fixes quite a bunch of explore.exe crashes related to the taskbar. And also here, as you can see, the issue with the taskbar is fixed. We now have a nicely shaped taskbar. And also these buttons are now fixed. As you can see, they have the rounded corners with the Windows 11 experience and also this button, which can help us get in here. And we also have more info if we hover over show hidden icons also with the rounded corners and the windows 11 design this is really cool so far this is everything that we have on the new taskbar but i think this is really cool but i can assure you that microsoft is working on improving the taskbar more and more and uh, from what i've heard we're going to have some new things added to the taskbar for example when the taskbar overflows with icons we might have a menu that appears up here with all the apps that are overflowed in the taskbar that would be also really good but what we have have now is also pretty good if you are on the latest dev channel build i highly recommend you to do this because this will also fix a lot of explore.exe issues and crashes related to the taskbar also the windows plus x one and this will also fix the system tray section of the taskbar with the icons that now have rounded corners and also this overflow menu with icons that you can have on the system tray this is really really cool and don't forget that the link to vive tool and also the command used in this video will be in the article down below in the description I hope you liked this video. If you did, don't forget to leave a like down below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.